Hey, my YouTubers and everyone in the world. Today is September the 25th. The time is now 4.41 p.m. Today was a rainy, rainy Tuesday all day. It wasn't really that cold, but it was extremely wet outside. I'm saying puddles here and puddles there and nothing but rain coming down. But today we're going to get into three easy tips on how to stop giving your power away. Now, when I say giving your power away, I mean, allowing people to make decisions for your life, you know, telling you what's best for your life as far as your job or maybe a relationship or maybe just something else that's going on in your personal life. So that's one way that we give our power away. One way we can stop giving our, our power away, of course, is by making decisions for ourselves. Yes, it's time to start making decisions for yourself. And don't be afraid to take a chance. Don't be afraid to take a chance. If you make a decision for yourself, completely stick by it 110%. Even if other people do not agree with what it is that you're doing, if you solely believe in your heart that what you're doing is right for you, then follow through with it, despite what anyone else has to say, because it's your life and you're walking your own path. So our second easy tip on how to stop giving our power away and my opinion is taking chances in life. How are you going to ever know if something works for you if you've never tried it before? So this is one this is easy step tip number 2. We have to be willing to take chances in life. Because life is 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 about taking chances. If something doesn't work for you, that's cool. See if there's something else that's going to work for you. But how would you know if you never taken a chance before? So you got to take chances. Tip number three on how to stop giving your power away. Honestly, I believe that allowing people to get under your skin gives so much power away. Like when people do things to try to purposely irritate us, you know, to try to get us mad, to try to hurt our feelings, and we allow them to actually get to us, you know, mentally and physically, that's a form of giving your power away. So stop letting people get under your skin. Stop allowing people to bother you to the point where, you know, this person knows what ticks you off. Because every time a person figures out what bothers you, they're going to continue to do it just to irritate you because they feel like they can. So why would you want to give them that type of power over your emotions? Stop giving your power away, guys. You know, I, I feel like another form of giving your power away is allowing people to dictate, you know, like I said before, what's best for your life, whether it's a relationship or whatever. The point is, no one is walking your path the way you're walking your path. You're the only one that can walk in your shoes. So at the end of the day, I hope that those three tips helped you guys on how to stop giving your power away. You know, stop allowing people to get under your skin and get the best of you. Stop allowing people to make decisions for you and what's best for your life, right? And, and, and just, you know what? Learn to take chances in life. Life is about taking chances. At least if we take a chance, we can say, okay, we tried that and it didn't work for us. Or we tried this and it worked perfectly fine. You know, sometimes you just got to readjust certain things and make it work for you. So like I always say, guys, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And of course, visit my website at shoploveronline.com. Until next time, you guys be safe and stop giving your power away willingly. Peace.